So our first demonstration tonight is with Angela. And Angela has been in Tupperware. Well, I'm going to let her tell you that. But I do want to tell you that she is a remarkable rock star in Tupperware. And she does uh, farm to table or field to table because she's 100% country girl. So let's turn it over to Angela Robaugh. Thank you, Angela. Take it away. Hi, guys. Welcome to my kitchen. My name is Angela Rorba and I have been in Tupperware for about 11 years. And it all started for me at a Tupperware bingo party. And I went in there and there were just so many things in the catalog that I wanted. I was never gonna be a Tupperware lady and I just wanted the discount. I just came in to get out and look at me. Here I am 11 years later and I absolutely love my business and it is, kept afloat through this whole crazy pandemic and it's racking better than ever right now for us. So um, I'm here to show you a really fun recipe that goes with this month. If you're not eating these every day for lunch, you're crazy because they're my favorite. <laughs> they are, um, it's a Reuben dip. Earlier today, I made a Reuben sandwich in here because there's two different settings on our micro pro grill. We're using our grill today. It is um, a micro pro grill and it goes in the microwave. We have two different settings. We have the casserole setting and then we also have the grill setting. Now on the inside of it, um, on the top, there is what's called a hot plate and on the bottom it has a hot plate or they're called scepters. And when you put this into the microwave, it gets hot really super fast. And the uh, microwave rays can't penetrate through here to cook your food. So it heats this up and the grill is actually what is heating, what is cooking your food. So that's really cool. There's a lot of different things that you can um, cook in here on the casserole mode. You can put your hot, hot leftover pizza and it keeps the bottom nice and crispy and the top gets nice and bubbly. So when you warm it up, it's like it just came out of the box from the delivery guy or, um, you can do casseroles and dips, which I'm going to use this mode today for the dip that we're going to make. Um, or you can put it on the grill mode and you can do your frozen pack of hot dogs in six minutes in the microwave with grill marks on it. You can do um, frozen burgers in here in six, seven minutes. I did a panini today, which was a Reuben sandwich. It's absolutely delicious. Uh, pork chops, blackened chicken for your salads, all of that right in here in the microwave super fast time, super easy. So this is our recipe. We have, first what I did was on the bottom, I put a one block of cream cheese and I just spread it around on the bottom, okay? And this is a Reuben dip. So that's the first thing that you wanna put down. Now next, I have corned beef. Now let me talk to you a little bit about corned beef, okay? There's two different versions that you can get. The first version is really delicious, well, they both are really, but um, you can go to your local butcher and they have corned beef that when it's fresh cut, they put it into a package that comes with a brine and that brine is marinated. It marinates that meat for about 14 days in the refrigerator. Then you can put it in the freezer. So, but it usually comes pretty in a pretty big package. Um, the local butcher by me, uh, Keller Meats, they have some absolutely delicious corned beef. So you can cook that in the oven all day. Um, in your, we have our beautiful cookware that goes in the oven and can go on top of the stove. So you can cook that all day and get it um, nice and cooked with your, um, um, oh my gosh, I can't even think, the uh, sauerkraut, sorry. <laughs> you, you can put it in there with your sauerkraut and uh, cook that all day and then shred it up and make your sandwiches or you can do the super fast way and go to your local um, deli and pick up some boar's head lunch meat. <laughs> so this is actually um, corned beef and it's, it's more expensive than the other lunch meats that you get, but it's absolutely delicious. Boar's Head is my favorite brand. This is our Clearly Elegant Bowl, as you can see. These come really handy, like Pam said, and I love these in my kitchen as well. So what we want to do is we're going to put it in our chopper. This is our beautiful three blade chopper and we have the three blades on the bottom and one pull by hand is over 100 or sorry one pull is over 100 chops by hand so as you're going to be able to see 
Um, we're gonna go, I'm gonna go ahead and put this inside of here and I'm gonna show you how fast and quick and easy this chops up. That was four and a half. I pulled it and look at that. Look how beautiful and chopped up that one treat is, okay? The corned beef is gonna go right on top now. And I am just gonna sprinkle this right on top. Delicious. All right. And we're gonna spread that around a little bit. All right. And this chopper also does come with a little funnel that goes on top. And we also have a whipping blade. So you can whip up your um, homemade Cool Whips and salad dressings and scrambled eggs and things like that. So this comes in handy as well. Right. And it comes with a liquid tight, airtight seal. In case you have whipped cream left over, I know that doesn't happen in my house, but if it does in yours, you have a liquid tight, airtight seal to keep it safe. All right. And then next, we're going to go ahead and put that sauerkraut right on top. So you just want to sprinkle it right all over the top here. And you can put a little or a lot, depends on how much you love your sauerkraut. I like a lot, so I put a lot more on there. Okay, and then the last thing is our Swiss cheese. Now we have a couple of different systems that go with this base. This is our master systems and this is our master shredder. Okay, so this is really nice because it all comes apart. Everything is dishwasher safe and it's really easy to use. So this is the base, you buy the base one time and then there's three different accessories. This is the master shredder accessory that goes with it that I'm using. So it goes right down on the counter. You take this and put it right on the top. It slides in and you twist and it locks right to your counter. And we're gonna take Swiss cheese. And let me tell you, fresh is always best. That is, I always say that in just about every demo that I do, fresh is always best. So um, it always tastes better, it's better for you, and no preservatives in there that you're feeding your family that are unwanted, right? Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and I'm just gonna throw this Swiss cheese in there and I'm gonna show you guys how fun and easy, I hope you guys can see it, how fun and cool it is to shred your cheese up here. Look how fast and easy that is and how beautiful and fluffy and wonderful our Swiss cheese is. So we're gonna go ahead and sprinkle this Swiss cheese all over the top. I love cheese, so I'm putting it all on there. Look at that, yum. All right, so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and put this in the microwave for about, oh, I'm gonna try five minutes and check on it. You just want it to melt and you wanna make sure that cheese is melting and bubbling up a little bit. And when it comes out, it's gonna be beautiful. And we're gonna go ahead and drizzle some, either some Thousand Island dressing on there or my favorite, Ken's Steakhouse Russian dressing. Oh, it's delicious. If you have a Reuben and you've never tried this, go on Amazon and buy it right now because it's really good, okay? And then what we're gonna use to dip in there is you can go to your store, or go to the store and get some Reuben um, bread, which is like a rye bread, and you can cut it up in little pieces, put some butter on it and toast it in the oven and use that to dip. Um, or you can open up your modular mate, part of your pantry system, and pull out your Triscuits. Triscuits are delicious to dip with this dip. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks. Thank you so much. That was awesome. Woohoo! Who's excited for some dip? Yes, I love dip. I love anything I can dip. If I'm dipping celery, if I'm dipping carrots, if I'm dipping crackers, and I love Triscuits and wheat thins too. All right, great job. Thank you, Angela. And so guys, all these recipes are given to your Tupperware director or Tupperware uh, uh, consultant for you tonight. So if you're a guest here with us and you want any of these recipes, you just message her and tell her what recipes you want. And of course, message her with your order too tonight. So if you see something on the screens that you're like, I need to have that cheese grater. I love that cheese grater. And you want to get that, you can go ahead and message her. She can send you a quick snapshot of the price and everything and all that stuff too. And so it makes it easy for you to shop tonight.